So today's topic is automation or augmentation of knowledge work jobs. And our guest speaker is Tom Davenport. The jobs that were most, uh, you know, knowledge and creativity and imagination and expertise oriented are the ones that uh, we, we have to start worrying about in this case. You know, maybe this will be the golden age of kind of cognitive systems um, integration. But then you get into this whole world at the top of automated analytics where we're not just trying to make a, a, a better decision, we're, we're taking action. We've embedded it, as I said, into systems and processes. A lot of use of machine learning uh, to create these models. They create about 5,000 new um, analytical models a week with a, you know just a few people that suggest uh, machine learning uh, is probably behind it. The big question for lawyers, and really the big question for all knowledge workers, I think is how can we make it likely that um, computers will augment legal jobs rather than automating them out of existence? You need to think about sort of how do I um, make the smart machine my colleague rather than my, my enemy or my, um, uh, someone I'm doing battle with. Specialize in a component of your job that can't be done well by a computer. So just to, to go back to the robo-advisor function, um, yeah, computers are really good at figuring out what your investment should be for a particular kind of risk profile and so on. Um, but they're not particularly good at persuading you to go out and um, open up an IRA or uh, put more money in your 401k. They don't inspire you to behavior change. So a good financial advisor um, might focus on the behavior change aspect of, of um, financial advice and not just you know sort of coming up with the answer. Do you think that the role of basically the data scientists what role do they play in that automation versus augmentation um, challenge? Augmentation is a lot of work if you do it on your own. You have to understand how these systems work. You have to um, uh, understand the logic, how you can add value, what are the strengths and weaknesses. So I think we'll see um, people partnering with data scientists to have them say, you know, what value can I add here?